Today, Pat Finn came, talked to us about improv, and he's been in a ton of improv things, Second City, Friends, Seinfeld. I'm uh, Pat Finn, Little Academy, 83. Uh, I think that's my locker right here, if you ever saw it. Always clean. It was just a really cool experience to see what he has done in Hollywood and to take away from it and learn. I was doing a charity event here in Chicago in a couple of shows and had a little window talking to the kids about improv and, and kind of how I started out. And I think just being here at Loyola and some of the things that I learned uh, and, and one of them was, was definitely giving back to the community and being somebody for others. I really gained a sense of like passion. Like you can feel he is so passionate about this subject that he came here to talk to us about it. From this experience, especially like, I mean, he gave me even some improv tips because we did those like games with him and stuff. So that was really fun and just being from Loyola, how it's helpful in anything you do and how improv can be used in absolutely any career. Doing theater or film or improv, that's, you're ahead of the, you're ahead of the game. You're ahead of where I was. You know, and if nothing else, and then you become a nurse, you can be the greatest nurse more so than somebody else because you took these kind of classes. You know how to relate to people. You know how to talk to people differently and think a little bit differently. Him coming in today, it was pretty cool because we learned you know, some do's and do nots and just saying that, you know, like you're going to have like a, a fork in the road. You have to pick whether if you want to, you know, choose your dream or not. My thing was I never wanted to be 50 years old sitting on a couch looking at a TV show saying I could have done that. You know what I mean? And I think that's a lot of it, the drive of doing something. Work hard and do what makes you happy. And that sounds weird, but I, I worked hard and I was in communications at Marquette, but this is the thing that made me happy. This is the thing that made sense to me. I like the idea of being on a stage after a while. I love the idea of being in front of cameras and, and making people laugh and moving around. Especially being an upcoming senior and thinking about college and graduating and jobs in the future, it's very comforting because you know that there's people out there who know where you come from and know the abilities that Loyola students have with them and carry with them for the rest of their lives. It motivated me because he was from Loyola, so that shows like if he can do it, maybe I can do it too. And if he can make it and be so successful, maybe anyone can do it too. I was able to come in and talk to the kids and now they all know the secret to comedy. 